Hey everyone and welcome to a new tutorial in uh, Fusion 360 Here I'm continue working on the um, Mini Copper S Here I would like to reverse the yellow surface It's called a normal surface Okay Just switch Switch it like this one And you have uh, the nice color gray you can uh, put another color if you want but i uh, would like to make this when we finish the car here i want to add the new surface here please if you like the tutorial make a thumbs up and if you have any question Please post it in the comment. Uh, people asked me about the blueprint. You can find it on the description. And also, you can download the 3D model. Uh, just go to my website, and there are uh, some episode. It will be uh, payable. Okay, not free you can find it on my website also to support my channel Here I'm using 3D sketch, just use M key to move all the points and I'm using 3D view to when I click um, to avoid to add a point on the plane. I want add the points on the edges or on the points as you can see here Khalid Khalaf uh, asked me and suggested me if I can leave the video as a fit and do not uh, accelerate the video. I think uh, it's a good suggestion. Thank you, uh, Khalid. I think uh, I will leave the video to um, like, uh, like this and do not accelerate it to more understand what i am doing but the the convenient of this one the videos make take um, more um, more time but um, i think the goal here is to to understand what uh, how you can work with the patch mode or surfaces uh, on uh, on fusion Uh, here in the middle of the car as you no notice that I'm uh, do here uh, horizontal because when you make a mirror of the car you do not see the line uh, the center line okay or the middle line okay when you make it horizontal or tangent to another line or when you make an axis that's the the goal to make it horizontal 
here as you can see I'm using the M key to move the um, to move the, the controllers and the points of the controllers here I will add another spline I'm starting from the left to have the first point on the middle of the car then I will move the second point in the X direction for that I'm using the arrow okay this one you can see it from the top because is on the bottom of the car this one is the same thing I will make it horizontal uh, SolidWorks user if you like uh, I will make a um, new car in SOLIDWORKS please leave me a comment I am looking for a new car to, to design it on SOLIDWORKS but after when I continue the V12 engine on SOLIDWORKS, FUSION and uh, INVENTOR after that I will start another series of uh, making car maybe on uh, on SOLIDWORKS please leave me a comment uh, to see what you like and you can follow me on Instagram and uh, find me also on uh, Facebook just tap camera 9 I will uh, you will find my page for that I um, I want uh, if you if you find my uh, I created a new group on uh, on Facebook for that you can uh, share with me uh, what you did when uh, uh, when you followed all this uh, exercise to make cars and engine I like to see uh, your your work and share it on the, the comment if you like on the page or on the group the name is camera 9 you will find it on the description if uh, if uh, you you can't find it by search And another thing uh, in the in the group or in the, in the page of um, Facebook, you can uh, you can send me or share uh, there uh, a problem you your, your um, you find uh, on your work on uh, life on the CAD okay in the mechanical uh, problem and I will try to make a quick quick tips or tutorial of that using fusion or SOLIDWORKS and inventor that's uh, that's helped me to find a new tutorial to share with you and and um, learning with you
I think that's I think it's all right. Just I will add a spline on the edge here. What I do that because I can't select when I make the patch here. I can't select only this um, this segment of this edge. For that I redesign it. Redesigning it. Here I will close the 3D profile. As you can see here, I turn it just a 3D view to to find the 3D uh, the the points. I add some bend here. I will bend it just a little bit. As you can see, now you can select all of it. Okay, that's a good work. I think I will stop the video now for today and I will try uh, to make a um, to make a mirror of this one to see what's look how it's look okay as you can see uh, you can select all of uh, the bodies and click mirror here Select just um, and you have nice result of mini copper here thanks for watching and see you in the next tutorial next week see ya